We're here at Alting in Essex and there's less than three weeks to go before our dough show starts. My name's Graham Parker, I'm the sales director for Ernest Doe and you might be able to hear in the background the setup of the show is well, well underway. I'm here with Ed Perry who's our general sales manager for Ernest Doe Power. Ed. Hello. <laughs> so um, Ed, tell me about the show. When do you start thinking about setting up the show? Well, really Carl Last, who's our demo manager, he's the key man for setting the show up. He thinks about it all year, but he really comes back in anger after Christmas with his whole team, five of them now running around and have been since Christmas setting it up. We see here the nucleus of the Case IH stand. We've got a lot of the tractors coming in now. All the suppliers are sending their kit in now uh, and the sales field is filling up. Okay, that's excellent. So, uh, Ed, you're responsible for the, the Case IH part of our business. Uh, what's going to be on the stand this year? Well, as usual, we'll have the full range of products. We'll have right from the new Quantum, which is an interesting product. That'll be its first showing here. The new Stage 5 Fruit and Vineyard tractor with a flat floor, very high spec. We've got high hopes with our new vineyard operation. We've got a permanent team now selling vineyard products. So we've got high hopes for that tractor. Then up, far more Maxim, Puma, all the normal stuff. The stand out there for us is the new Puma AFS Connect, the new long wheelbase Puma with the Optin cab. We will have that tractor here on the stand. It's the same one that was at Lama last week. Um, that's our biggest selling tractor, so that is really a key product for us. We've also got the Optum, which is newly launched, the second generation of the Optum. We'll have the 300 CVX here. That's another key selling tractor for us that will be here. On from that, Magnums, um, quad track, combines, the full range will be here, Graham. So the Optum, Ed, what's the, uh, the, the, the model range of that tractor and the horsepowers? So the Optum is 250 to 300 horsepower. Um, it's a very versatile tractor. You know, it's a big tractor, 300 horsepower, but it's not a Magnum. Perfectly feasible to put the Optum on a trailer, but for heavy cultivation work, it's also ideal. It, it, you know, it really is a very versatile tractor for somebody who wants a little bit more than a Puma and is a big selling tractor for us. Excellent. So combine wise, what's gonna be on the stand? So we'll have nice 250 on the stand, 250 range being our big seller. We've also done very well in recent years with the 150, but we will have a nice 250 with a 35 foot header here on the stand. And you talked a little bit about the quantum for the, uh, the fruit and viticulture industries. Uh, how's that tractor going to fit in? I think that tractor's going to fit in well to that sector. You know, it's a very high spec tractor. It is competitively priced. Um, it's a tractor that we haven't had available to us for over a year because of the switch over from stage four to stage five engines. Um, we've certainly ordered a good lot for stock. We've already sold some this year and we've got very high hopes for that tractor. So Ed, so we've got the Quantum tractor. Uh, what about the implements that go behind then? What, uh, what brands are we selling? So it's a new sector for us, Graham. You know, we've had to take some expert advice and we've been out, we've been around Europe. We've been to Italy, we've been to France. We've spoken to some real industry experts and we think we found the products that are actually going to be perfect for our conditions here in the UK. We've got Provitis, we've got Dondi, Ideal, Bertu, several others. Um, we've picked some good franchises. 